Well, it is Tuesday, and that means Election Day is now just a week away. Early voting ending this Friday, and already half of Travis County eligible voters have made their choice. Today, Travis County Clerk Dana DeBouvoir will update county commissioners. And one of the biggest questions she has is, will the large number of mail-in ballots delay the results that we see on Election Day? Candy says that she checked in and she shared why the county clerk believes that is not going to be a problem. Travis County Clerk Dana Debuwa says they've sent out over 83,000 mail-in ballots. So far, they've gotten two-thirds of them back. Debuwa says this should help with election night tabulation. I don't think Travis County is going to be one of those places that's got, um, you know, big delays and big problems. Debuwa credits voters for acting fast and getting ballots in early. It includes both postal delivery and hand delivery. She says this is important because the process of counting mail-in ballots can take a lot of time. Because we go to, through different steps, you know, with auditing and signatures and, you know, and the intent of the voter and all of that, I, I don't, I think each step might take 20 or 30 minutes. Because of this, Debuwa says she's hired an additional 100 people to help out and keep the process moving now and into election night that it's very likely will be substantially completed this time by midnight. Debuwa believes this election could break the county's highest turnout record to date, which stands at 77 percent. It was set back during the 2008 election. She estimates we could see 80 percent voter turnout. Back to you. Okay, Candy, thank you. Last week, remember, we told you how some Travis County voters even got a second mail-in ballot due to an error on the district mapping and some wrong instructions. Well, Dana Debuwa knows that. She says they had to resend more than 12,000 mail-in ballots because of that error. Uh, she says that once voters sent back the corrected ballot, it will be counted. The first one will not. If voters, you do not return the second ballot, then your first one will be counted.